This is the macro show. This is pregame, okay? We're trying to play the game that's in front of us today. You know, leadership matters at Hedge Eye. So again, being transparent, accountable, and trustworthy people. This is a game about playing and weighing probabilities. It's not about picking stocks. It's about picking the right portfolio. How do you reconcile your bullish gold view with Hendry's view, it will be a major source of liquidity. And I think, you know, part of the difference there may be on time frames or duration as well. Although well, I mean, I mean, all due respect to you, I, I don't give a shit what he thinks about that. I mean, I, <laughs> and I don't think he cares about what I think either. I mean, you know that, right? The process doesn't take someone's narrative and say, therefore. The process takes components of conversations, components of books, had a lot of talks about this. Don't read any of the books that I told you to read and say, you know, cover to cover, like Jim Gatherall's volatility surface is the written rules of God. I mean, there's a lot of, a lot, a lot in there that you should not use or apply to the process. If somebody says something, I don't do something, right? A better example is, is so Daniel DiMartino Booth last year said, Powell has grown a pair. He's going to stay way more hawkish than people believe. All that did to me was help me believe my bond yield signals, right? It didn't change what I, you know, the bond yield signals were already signaling that. And it just helped me believe that. If just somebody says that gold's gonna stop going up because people are gonna need it for liquidity, I mean, my signal doesn't believe that. So why would I believe that, right? Is it okay to be that way? I hope so. I've spent 24 going on 25 bloody years, you know, successfully doing that, right? Hugh Henry's not risk managed every single market very well. He doesn't know everything, and neither do I, right? But we're quite, uh, we might be quite good friends after what he called this encounter, right? <laughs> Irishman and Canadians. Think about it. The guy is the son of a Scottish truck driver, and here's the son of an Irish Canadian and a French mom, uh, eh? uh, you know, firefighter. Just having just a great discussion where he's not going to turn around and like change everything he thinks because of what I said and neither the other way around. It's fine. It's okay. It's not the way the business works. Not anymore. Hey there, Hedge Eye Nation. Or if you're not part of Hedge Eye Nation, thanks for watching Hedge Eye on YouTube. If you haven't already, make sure to click on the button below there. Subscribe to our YouTube page. You can also follow the link in the description to our website to get even more great investing content.